Hey everyone. So there are some few things related to course I would like to discuss in this video. So I would highly suggest you please please do not skip this video. This video will give you a complete overview what we are going to exactly learn in this course. And there are some few important things related to course I will discuss later on. All right. So we'll get started our journey with a very basic introduction with NLP what nlp fields are what are the different applications of nlp and then no much theory we'll just straight dive into a uh, installation part so we'll see how to get started on google collab environment mainly there are two libraries which will be our focus a spacey library for nlp and nltk so in the next section we will see some of the basic natural language processing related tasks and all those tasks like uh, tokenization stamming lemmatization stop word removal vocabulary part of speech tagging everything we will see with this spacey library and this particular course is very much hands on so there are many practical projects on which we are going to work upon so one of them is a uh, spam classification then whether a restaurant reviews prediction will be a good or bad amazon IMDb Yelp review classification project and at the end we will see two more projects actually one of them is a automated text summarization and twitter sentiment analysis so that is mainly a very first part of the course where mainly we are going to work upon machine learning related technique and we'll be applying this machine learning technique on the top of this text data in the next part of this course or i would say a second part of this course our main focus will be on a deep learning part so we'll start with the basics of deep learning and for deep learning basics part with me my friend vijay is going to join with you we'll learn about the word embedding we'll learn about the how to do this text classification with advanced deep learning technique like a convolution neural network recurrent neural network and there is a one full fledged project we will see like automated text generation with tensorflow keras and a lstm and for those of you who just want to refresh their concept related to data science data pre processing data analysis so for them there are three bonus section i have added like numpy library pandas library and a matplotlib library grace course and at the end in the appendix i have added a text processing so whenever you want to deal with uh, any kind of file in a python or text file in a python pdf file in a python how to deal with that so that part is included in a appendix so overall i can say that it's a very comprehensive course complete course is full of practicals only and this is about the basic course overview so now apart from course overview there are few things about how to proceed for the course i would like to discuss mainly it is uh, related to some of the technical stuff so this is the player in which you will be able to see your all videos you can see if you think that my voice is very much slow you can just increase your playback rate or if you want to change the streaming quality you can change it from here and i would highly suggest you to watch all those video in a hd quality at least in a 720p frame now another important thing is review reviews are important as a instructor for us also and as a student to you also based on your review only other student can find this useful course so i would highly suggest you that after watching some 10 or 15 minutes of video udemy will ask you for reviews so you can give your reviews in terms of stars so maximum you can give it like a five star and if you want to provide some feedback you can provide it in terms of text but i would highly suggest you just to get read out of those particular screen just do not give rating randomly because it will hurt also it will discourage us so and it will demotivate us to further down the contain updation so your review is very much important and please better take care of reviews so that it will keep motivating us 
to further creating more and more content all right so these are the some of the basic thing and from the next video let's just proceed ahead with what is natural language processing